What up, my dudes? Welcome back. We are doing another draft. I'm going to do this Kerwitz stipulation. It says you must play all cards taken within the first five picks of each pack. I don't know if Kerwitz is still here or not. But we're going to do it anyway. Anyway. Stipulation. It's happening. First five picks. I mean, Golos is a pretty safe pick. And we all know I love Golos anyway, so. Okay, Golos into, and this art is banging, too bad the card is terrible. I think it's Golos into Boros Signet. I like Golos into Scalding Tarn. Hmm. I mean, I'm not going to commit to some, I'm going to be honest, I mean, like, I'm not going to commit to some crazy cards in the first opening packs, but I'm going to take Boros Signet. I rarely see Signets, so... Um, Woodland Cemetery, we got Gonti. Treasure map seems good. I'm just going to call Mono Artifacts here in the first picks, man. Oh, what up, Thrift Thriftin' Mitch? Uh, we're sideboarding this because I want to know what the first five picks of every pack are. The stipulation is your first five picks have to be played, so I'm putting them in the sideboard so I know what they are, so I cannot not play them. Because once we get to, like, pack, pick 7, pick 9, pick 12, like, it's going to be real confusing, and I'm not going to remember what was our first picks. So I'm going to put these in the side, give a little screenshot, and then we'll put them in the main deck so that they're not, you know, invisible. Glacial Fortress. Whatever I take, I gotta play. What does Bishop of Binding do? Enters an alpha exile creature from controls until it leaves. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna take Glacial Fortress. We have Golos, so I'm not gonna pretend I'm not... Like, this is the most five-color format ever, and I'm not gonna pretend I'm not gonna play Golos and try to activate Golos. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Wow. Wow. Just incredible. Oh, Plateau. It goes with Boros Signet and Glacial Fortress. Yeah, we're taking the Plateau. Maybe we're just Jeskai splashing for Golos. Okay, these are our first five pick. We can do whatever the fuck we want. Okay. I'm going to call this pack one. Now they're all going in the main. Okay. Now we can take whatever we want. I like Aleshnorn here. I also like Demir Aqueduct. I think Aleshnorn's better. I'm going to take Aleshnorn. That's what I say whenever Frank is in the queue. Do a step. <laughs> All right. God, I love Angel of Despair. I think it's such a great card. Um, is Are we a momentary blink deck? We got Golos. I can't take Nicol Bolas again, right? Right? Right. It's right. <sighs> Maybe I can. Who knows? I kind of like, I like, I kind of like momentary blink with Golos. Dude, I just like Nicol Bolas so much. It's double black, though. Ugh, God. This is all I want to do. Fuck it. 
that's it's like i'm just like if i take like blade splice or a momentary blink i'm just like i don't care about all that i don't want to play this stupid deck with like boo here's a three drop deal with my three i just don't care about those guys i'm just gonna draft the same exact deck as last time apparently is it just elite guard mage here are we just literally four color non-green again i mean this guy's great I don't think it's Cavalier. Triple White's pretty rough. I don't think we want to jump into green. This guy is both of our colors. If the momentary blink comes back, it's also very good with both of these. So, Frankie's taking Nickel Ball. It's that one dude that hates Greg. So he can't keep getting away with it. And he won't. I like Kiora, actually. Being able to untap a land here is pretty good, especially with bounce lands in the format. I'm gonna take the Kiora. Well, this pack's pretty bad. We're either forced to take a green card or a really weird other colored card. Uh, I guess we'll take Moren. Maybe we play it if we're five colors. We got Golos, maybe we're five colors. Actually, maybe Erebos' intervention is just fine. Yeah, all Erebos' intervention. Ooh, D Spark was real good. It might be better than Oblivion Ring. I don't know, though. Oblivion Ring hits anything. I like Pelucranos. Okay, now we're just now we're just in it. Now we're just in the five colors. I just can't like. We got to a point where the only good cards were green cards, so. So right now we have to take glacial plateau, but I don't have a problem playing any of those cards. Take a look. Oh, Gitchrog Frog. I was actually kind of hoping that guy came back. Now I'm hoping I can draw open five. Uh... All right, we're gonna put these in the main deck for now. So that my sideboard is purely the the picks. That's not even terrible, to be honest with you. Okay. I'm pretty sure it's going to be land here. Bye, Michael. I kind of like Gross Chamber. Okay. Okay. Gotta play whatever we hit. Gotta play it. I don't love it, but I gotta play it. So far, our four drops are white, white, blue, black, green, black, green. That's cool. Dang it. I think it's just walk the aeons here or price of fame i think i like walk the aeons better okay those are two oh rakdos carnarium seems nice and healthy Take a look. It's in a book. All right, we're not doing this again. I think it's actually just Elspeth Conqueror's death here. Knight of Autumn also pretty good. Elspeth Conqueror's death is going to be better. Rot Farm. Do we just go all in on the bounce lands? Interesting. Whatever I pick, I gotta play. I kind of like Great Henge, to be honest. I think I play it better than Rot Farm here. All right, 
This is our second five. Save as pack two. Okay, got him. And again, they're all coming in the deck. Hangerback might not make the cut. Airbus Intervention might not make the cut. Let's figure out these lands. So white, blue, black, red, green. For now we have one, two white. Blue we have two blue. Red we have two red. Black we have one. And green we have one, okay. Are there are we still are we still alive? Can someone in chat let me know if we're still alive? Oh, okay, never mind. We did it. We made it. Fabro Elder is pretty sweet. Yeah, let's take Fabro Elder here. I think it's probably gonna be better than Fire Mine Vessel. Oh, Savannah? I like it. Uh, green now has two, white now has three. Taiga? Oh, baby. Yep. All the dual lands. Red is three, green is three. We're killing it. We do need some black. Let's see a bayou. Nope, can't let you know. Well, joke's on you. I already know. <laughs> I think my first, this ain't my first internet rodeo. It's my second. So I'm basically an expert. Oh, Hollowed Fountain came back? That's pretty juicy. Genesis Ultimatum came back? That's pretty juicy. Tatiova came back? That's pretty okay. <sighs> I do think it's Hollowed Fountain. No, it's gotta be Genesis Ultimatum. I'm not a maniac. Oh, Price of Fame came back. That's kind of cool. Triple blue is going to be rough. But we got the green and the red on lockdown. Now we need blue-black lands. Give me some blue-black lambs. Lambs? Give me those lambs. Tatiova pudding. I don't even know what that means. Oh, tapio it's a tapioca joke. Thank you. Um, I kind of just like Discovery Dispersal. Gigantha's kind of cool, but I don't think I'm in Gigantha-ing. Runaway Steven, thank you so much for the, for the sub, buddy. Really appreciate it. I think I'd rather just have this. You gotta be kidding me. Give me those blue black lands, man. Oh my god, we could have so many ultimatums. Mmm, I like that. Oh my god, we have three ultimatums right now. 
Dude, this is the same deck, right? Cruel Ultimatum, Nicol Bolas. Nineteen eleven. All right. Let's get our let's get our sideboard ready. Put everything over here in this right column. Oh, great hench might be playable. I don't. I think that was in our sideboard. Okay, we're looking for primarily blue and black lands. I like Savage Lands, but I think the Dragon Skull Summit might be better. Like, we already have... What do we have here? Simic Growth Chamber, Rakdos, Carnair. I guess we only have two lands that come into play tapped. I think Savage Lands might be fine. Yeah. I agree. And so that's two black, four green, and four... Oh, Steam Vents is nice. Carol, I'm taking all the lands these first picks, buddy. Steam Ventos. We want more blue. So now we have three blue and five red, which is good because both of these need double red. I don't think we need any more red lands, though, really. Isolated Chapel could be okay. Noxious Gearhole could be good. Solemn Simulacrum actually seems like it's a banger. It's really funny that the momentary blink didn't come back. It's funny because Golos and Gitrog Monster and Pelucranos all survive Frost and Fire. I think we're just taking Solemn here. Actually, I kind of like Isolated Chapel. It, it goes well with Plateau, Savannah. And that's pretty much it. Yeah, I'm going to take the... I'm going to take the Isolated Chapel. So we got four and three. Windswept Heath. Okay, that's perfect. Windswept Heath gets a green. So green goes up to five. Does it get a red? Oh, yeah. That goes up to six. Does it get a black? Not yet. Does it get a blue? No. But it does get a white. All right, one more pick, and all those cards have to be played. Hmm. Scrubland seems great, because now it, it's actually two black sources. It's one white source, so we go up to six, and it turns... Uh, it turns our windswept teeth into a black source as well. So that's actually insane. All right. So pack three. Nice. That was great. Okay. Everything goes over here. These three go over here. So this is our deck. We only need four more playables. And I like everything that's in here. Great Henge could be good. Arid Mesa gets white, blue, red, green, and black right now. It's got to be better than Crumbling Necropolis, right? It's just got to be. Omnath seems pretty sweet here. Okay, so we actually have seven, four, six, seven, six. Our mana base is pretty nuts. I actually just hope we have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve lands? We still have five basics? Also, Binding the Old Gods gets... Um, gets Taiga and Savannah right now, along with Basic Forest if we add one. And now it gets Overgrown Tomb as well. Yeah. 
Yep, that's pretty good. I'm actually surprised we've only seen one signet. Yep, Overgrown Tomb is now seven and seven on black and green. That's insane. Just gonna take lands. Like I have no incentive not to. Black is now eight. Red is now eight. All right, sure. I wish I took that hollowed fountain, but I think it's fine without it. I think we get three basics after this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Yeah. Escape to the wilds. Also, Justice Strike seems pretty sweet here. I think I just want the Justice Strike. I think our card advantage is good. We got Omnath. Um, Elite Guard Mage draws us a card. Gitrog is going to get us some value. Kiora. I think I just want some cheap things. Some cheap interaction here. It's really unfortunate that a lot of our blue cards are like double blue, triple blue, double blue, but. Huh. That's a big game. Eternal Witness is also real sweet here. Sure. Oh, Rex Sage seems great. Especially because we didn't we didn't pick up the um. Huh. Vigilance Reach Trample. When it enters the battlefield, if you cast on Temple Lands, you control. That's fine. Because <laughs> we didn't pick up the Knight of Autumn, is what I was going to say. This deck looks wild. I think we're cutting Lesh Norn. Oh my god, Orzhov Basilica last pick? That's interesting. I think I want white and black over white and r I think I want the I want the Basilica over the Carnarium did I take the Carnarium in the first any of the first picks oh damn it I gotta play the Carnarium okay so I guess we gotta cut one thing I definitely don't think we need Inspired Ultimatum. I want to be able to cast my things. Do we cut Zakama? Nine mana's a lot. Look at our mana base. Oh my god. We only have, th we have three bounce lands. One, two, three. I think that's too many. I think we have to play Simic and we have to play Rakdos Carnarium. I think we only play two though. So we have to play Rakdos and Simic. Yep, okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, six. Oh, we have to play Great Henge, actually. It was in our. So we'll definitely play that over as a comma. I think we can board in Rex Sage. Okay, let's make sure there's nothing else that we have to play. Pack one. Uh, treasure map, Golos, Boros, Signet. Got those. Glacial, Plateau. We're going to play those anyway. Pack two. We have Elspeth, Walk, and Great Henge. Also, Rakdos, Carnarium, and Simic, Growth Chamber. We have Elspeth, Great Henge, Walk. Yep, got those. Pack three. It was all lands. Steam, Scrub, Savage, Team Scrub Savage, Isolated Windswept. Yeah, we were going to play those anyway as well. Along with those. And this looks like our sweet deck. <laughs> um, sort by color. No, this is actually fine. Okay. You know the drill. Our white, we have 8. Blue, we have 12. Black, 10.
red, nine, green, 12. Okay. White sources. I believe we have seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Nailed it. Blue sources is low. Uh, one, two, three, nope, four. Yep, got that as well. Black and red, we both have eight. Black, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Red, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And green, we have seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, that's all correct. Ever gone XC skiing around the neighborhood? That looks amazing. <laughs> I have not done that. I actually don't own skis because I'm from Florida and I didn't live in cold climates until this year. So, <laughs> oh boy, good times. Here, let me show that for you guys on YouTube. Nice. Get your ski on, guys. Okay, so we have the most green and the most blue. We have the least white. So seven sources of white actually seems fine. I think we actually want three islands. Because right now, we have the most blue. The most We have the second most green, and we have seven sources of green. Oh. Yikes. I think we definitely want at least two blue. I don't think we want this white. This puts us at seven and seven, which is not great. But we do have Fabro Elder, Kiora. I think it's got to be this. Because then it's like seven, seven, eight, eight, seven. And I think that's actually fine. I don't love having triple island. But drawing the third island is only bad when you have Cruel Ultimatum. Otherwise, it's usually just fine. I think this could be fun. We're going to see what's going to happen. All right. Let's jump into the arena with this bad boy. <laughs> nice. Tano's giving me the straight answers now. Mm. I like this. Snap it off. I think I think Catherine is home. Lady Catherine has arrived. Oh, Kerwin, this is literally your stip. Yeah, I'm here and I'm dead. You just did your stip. So you know, here are the picks. First pack, the five picks were Glacial Plateau, Boros Signet, Treasure Map, Golos. Second pack, we had Rakdos, Carnarium, Simic Growth Chamber, Elspeth, Walk the Aeons, and Great Henge. Third pack, we had Isolated Travel, Savage Land, Scrublands, Steam Vents, Windswept Heath. We went heavy on the Golos five color theme here. So next turn, we're going to go a Savannah. Hey, babe. Hey, babe. Hi. You come sit over here? Oh, that'd be sweet. Well, well, well. If it isn't the Stone Coil Serpent herself. Hmm. Yeah. I guess I'll turn your microphone on. Oh, it's it was already on. I forgot to turn it off. Oh, yeah. You're being careful there? Okay. You did good. You did good. Can you come in a little more? I feel like you're... I feel like I'm talking behind me. I am behind you. That's that's why I feel I think that you're way. You're just real close today. Should I should I be back as far as you? Yeah. Mm, I don't know. Twelve feet away. Twelve feet away. Hi, Stone Coil Serpent. <laughs> See, everybody knows, babe. Where they get an island? Boring. I'm just kidding. Islands aren't boring. We all know that. <gasps> Why don't bonk your little head? 
Do I want this? I don't think so, but maybe... Yeah, I'm not going to get greedy. Are you coming closer? Yeah, well, I think he's bonking his head. Well, that's because... Oh, Jesus. The whole desk shook. It's still shaking. Wow, this is... God, the whole room gets destroyed. Well, look, I can't get any... This is as close as it gets. I, there's that thing. Well, you You're just... too close. This is close. I just want to sit right here. Okay. My bad, babe. Yeah. One, two... <laughs> yeah, you're, you're bad. bad. Yeah, okay. Look at all these lands. Next time we can play Big Frog. Are you ready for Big Frog, babe? Mm, I bet. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? That was the best frog impression I could do. I think it was good. I fixed our towel holder in the bathroom. The thing was driving me insane. Again? Yes. So does that mean it's permanently fixed, or does that mean it's fixed for another, like, two weeks, and then it'll break again? It's hard to say what, what happens. Hmm. Three, four, five. Hi, Wally Ray. Let's Golos here. Let's put, since we have a Genesis Ultimatum in the hand, let's get a Simic Growth Chamber. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Are you <laughs> talking to me? I don't know. I'm okay. kind of talking to Wally. Okay. Well, that's fine. I'm going to bounce. So, no, we need green, green, blue, 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 red, red. I guess we'll just bounce the Isolated Chapel. Do that Two, then. Three, four, five, six. I did. Okay. What? I don't know if we can play this next time. I think we can, right? We got blue, 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 green, green, red, red. Yeah, we can. We can Genesis ultimate him next turn. Oh, boy. Are you okay? Are you tired? Yeah. How was your day? It's better than yesterday. Wow, that's, that's, that's a low bar. Are they going to just spin the wheel with Urza? No, they got to do something bigger than that. They got to kill our Golos. That's not going to do it at all. Oh boy, we're having a good time now. Oh, actually, we don't even care about that. We were gonna play Genesis Ultimatum, right? Right. What were you gonna say? Are you playing all the colors of the wind? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. And painting with them as well. Mm. I'm not good at painting. Can you ever have you heard the? You already messed it up. You're only one word in. <laughs> Are you, what are you laughing at, babe? I was laughing at your bad song. Okay, well, that's that's hurtful. Well, I looked lovingly at Wally's little face. So here's what we can do. We can either Genesis Ultimatum, mm -hmm. look at the top five cards, put any of the permanents onto the battlefield, and then the rest into your hand. How good are your cards? They're pretty good. Or we can Golos. Excel the top three cards of your library. You may play them this turn without paying their mana cost. So we get to either play all three or look at five and play the permanents. I think and I just, what does I, their deck do? I don't know. Mm. But I just committed to this because I forgot we didn't have a black. Now I have to do this. So. Well, in that case. <laughs> you know, you're real sassy today, okay? I'm real sassy every day. Why? Oh. You mistapped your... That one. Yeah. This has got to be a red. This is going to be a green. This is going to be a... Oh, good. We get three lands. And an Eternal Witness, which doesn't get anything back, so we're just going to put that in our hand for now. Oh, wow. That was not good. It wasn't. It wasn't that good. She's not wrong. Remember when you said you had good cards? I don't know where they are. Um, yeah, let's just attack this immediately with both. Moon, come on, moon. Five is better than three, I agree, but not not better than those. I mean, Golos wouldn't have actually been any better. They're just gonna let it die. Weird. Okay. Well. Yeah, you get those. Get those legs moving. Okay, they can play that land. Now they got forest on top. 
And I got a Dream Eater. Okay. What are you looking at? Sky? <laughs> it's looking at how many cards they have in hand. They have three. I see that. I know one of them. You know two of them, I thought you said Dream Eater. Dream Eater's the one, this forest is on top, so I just wrote it down preemptively. So that I know oh, it's yeah. going to be there. Golos would have eaten those lands up, that's true. At least this time we drew them. Which is just food for the Gitrog monster. Gitrog? <laughs> oh. Babe, are you doing okay? No, I shouldn't have come in here. Oh, that makes me sad. <laughs> this is our relationship. She just she just regrets being near me. It's not true. I shouldn't have come in here. I just probably wasn't the right energy for this for this whole shebang. I think Forrest is going. Shindig. Shindig would have been a better sh word. I went to the garage and I didn't find any mice. Mice scare me. I don't understand, but that's okay. There's something in my eye. Is it a mouse? <laughs> Probably. What are they bouncing here? Both of our creatures are good. Oh, it's non-land permanent? I guess they could bounce our treasure. <laughs> you doing okay? You want me to call the hospital? <laughs> what is this big black line? You got the, Can you close that? That I leaned into it and popped my back. Okay. Is it? Oh god. Is this? It? It's got to be to the edge. It's literally <laughs> just like, uh, you're gonna bounce a Golos. Okay. <coughs> just doing big coughs. There's still something in my eye. <laughs> this is not my finest moment. Oh, they swing. They do big swings. Yeah, that's fine. Why is the serpent tired? <laughs> okay, we're going to get overgrown here because this one definitely gets scrubland. And I don't know what else we have. So, no. Yeah, okay. So, those are all our lands. Did you write down Ooh, the deck list? Omnath stays. No, but I meant to. Rookie mistake. Okay. Like I'm the one that's been on the torture. Well, I didn't want to say anything. Two, three, four. It's been a long few days at work. That's why I'm tired. This is actually a million mana. Oh, look what we drew. Uh, the other one. Let's get a Carnarium. Bounce Island. Uh, Thank you. Play... Woo! Chapel as our land. That'll give us four. We'll add a black to play Gitrog. Now we'll play a plateau as our second land for the turn. Wait, what? Oh boy, you getting excited. Oh, each opponent inch planeswalker. I thought I killed their creatures for some reason. I guess I'm a dum dum. Dum dum. <laughs> okay, well, our board is still pretty sweet, so. There is a law and order SVU joke in there. Dum dum. <laughs> You didn't even thank Ayako Paul for joining the. What are they called? I'm sorry, I just got real into it. The brood. Ayako Paul, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. One year. Oh my goodness. What is it called? The Brood Mothers? What are they in? What is your group called? The Brood Mothers? <laughs> yes. Yeah, welcome to the Brood Mothers. Thank you guys for joining. <laughs> what really. is it? I mean, I, I used to call it the Sultai Brood. Oh yeah, that's, what that's comes just up what over it's there. Oh, they're just going to cast this Brawl's expertise and bounce my three creatures? Hmm. Well, Ayaku Po can be the brood mother of the Sultai brood. You got it. What do they get to play for free, I wonder? A oh, bloop. Okay. Welcome to the brood mothers, everybody. Wow, this is actually real good. If you just cast from anywhere other than your hand, put those cards in your hand so they just get to draw three. So now you know they have forest.
Oh my god. Hunter disrupted the green screen. I see. I don't know why it didn't show me. Usually since they're they're top of the de since their top of the deck is revealed, I sh feel like I should have been able to see the cards they drew. But I did not. Classic. <laughs> Okie dokie. Well, what do we do here? Things are happening. What? Me and Wally are just sitting here. Oh, it is it is it in the game log? Uh, Fibble Tooth cast. They cast See the Truth. No, and then I'm just being attacked. Yeah, that's not great. Okay. So cruel. They're probably just going to sacrifice the 1 1. 2 3. 1 2 3 4 5 6 7. Oh, this is also 2. Can we do everything? This is actually really complicated. Um. So I kind of want to just shoot this and shoot this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This is 14. One, two, three, four, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Do we have three blue? One, two, three, we do. Do we have three black? Black, 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 yes. Okay. Let's go. This, this. And red green. Do we have a red green wind? Mm -hmm. It's right in the middle of your screen. <laughs> no, but I mean like a land that just produces. I'm just trying to figure out the. I want to not mess this up. It's very difficult. Red. And now I just need a white. Nothing else needs green, so this is perfect. So we can go this guy. Draw our card. There's a great henge. Um, play our land gain four okay so black nothing needs white so we can use these as black um blue blue red red am i short of blue yes i am short one but I can flip this guy, and then we're talking. Three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. Uh, bottom that guy. Now, now we got it. All right. So we can go. This is complicated, guys. Black, red, black, black, red, blue red black electrolyze shoot these two nerds i'll use one of the black mana boros signet and then we got blue blue cruel ultimate on your face great job Ben. <laughs> it was a it was a whole thing Next time we can eternal witness cruel to him again. How many draft picks are you playing? That's that deck is loaded. <laughs> Let's make sure we play land. We have nine cards. I'm just gonna play signet here. I don't foresee us needing <laughs> to draw cards off of the clues. Um, just gonna hold back here. Discard an island. Wow, that was a wild turn. Some would call that. They drew lantern. A doozy. That was definitely a doozle. So we know they drew. La wow, did you see that? Watch this. Watch them dance. We have a good time. It's like a country line dance. Look at them kick. Everyone in the everyone in the chat's getting motion sickness. What does this get? Brawl's expertise again? I mean just I just get to keep playing Omnath though? I mean that seems fine. We have ten cards though. We do have to win this game in a short amount of time. Mm hmm One, two, 
3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 mana. <laughs> Not enough. I, so I can go Omnath, Eternal Witness, Cruel Ultimatum. Look at these dogs. There's dogs everywhere. That's how I like it. <laughs> That's how I like it. Hi, Watson. Did Watson have a good day? Watson was great today. But did he have a good day? You're going to have to ask Watson. Watson, did you have a good day? Yes, mother. I had a wonderful day. Is that, is that Watson? Wow, what a weird voice. Oh, I didn't. I played my land first. This is when things are getting complicated, guys. <laughs> Don't look at Watson, just focus on your game. So 16 mana. This is 7, 10, and then 6 left over. Hmm. Each opponent returns a non permanent if they control the highest card of mana cost, then discards a card. Like, I kind of just want to kill this thing. So I play this for six. This costs three. I think that's probably correct. And then we can play Nicol Bolas, steal their Magus. That seems good. Let's do that. One, two, three. And we can go land, green, green. Henge, one blue. So we got black, black, blue, red, one, two, Nicol, Nicholas B. Is he uh, related to Michaelis B? <laughs> <laughs> Steal your Magus. So I have one card in hand, you're drawing World of Rogue, that's fine. Oh, did we get to just play that off the top? Yes, but we're not going to because we're going to hold on to it for our Omnath next turn. All right. That was our turn. Boy, this is a game right here. They have 18 minutes. We have 12 minutes. You gotta do big counts. I do gotta do big counts. This is, what game is this? Game one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Big counts, babe. I think I might need to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Go 13, hibernate. 18. This is fifteen lands. Two more lands in the deck, so we can find something with Golos. Play this. That's two. Gains us an extra four with Omnath. You can go hibernate. Okay. This is way too much. I know. It's way too much for me, and it's I'm not even. I haven't even had the day that you've had, so. Okay, they have no cards in hand. That seems good. Maybe they'll just concede. You know, maybe. Someday. I mean, I feel like we're going to accrue ultimatum them to death, but, like, also it kills us. Yeah, like, how many times are you going to do that? Not many with nine cards in our deck. Exactly. I wish I had a way to shuffle. I think you need to. This is my ability? Thank you! No, it's not. Sir Ryag. Oh God, this guy's gonna let me draw two. Is this my ability? Oh God. Oh dear. Oh God. Oh, there's Niv Mizzet on the top. All right. Well. Hmm. Well, let's play this guy. One, two, three, four. Use the black. No, use the red. Oh yeah. Oh god, we're gonna just deck ourselves here. It's gonna be terrible. Mm-hmm. You are correct. Uh, let's kill this thing. Uh, one, two, three. Uh, 
Elspeth Conquers Death seems fine. Put on top. Put on top. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five. Doesn't even matter anymore. You're in the danger zone. <laughs> Very true. He's like gonna draw an ancestral. Well, they're in top deck mode here. We can deal two to them right now. Woo! I know. Everything in my two. hand draws me cards, dude. Yeah, you need to do less of that, which goes directly against our nature. It's very true. I just got good news. I was accepted to study Masters of Teaching. I will be a science and maths teacher in two years. Oh, that's exciting. That's awesome. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we can play Eternal Witness. One, two. Wait, what are you Eternal Witnessing? I don't know. Electric, no, Justice Strike? Yeah, I guess it's Justice Strike. Oh, God, we draw another card because of the friggin' Henge. So sorry. <laughs> um, oh, God, this is painful. Are you in a different country, such as Britain, where they say maths, plural? Uh, let's go white. Oh, we don't have a white. Oh, no. Oh, God, we can't do anything right now. Lack of white. Okay, I guess we'll just go. <gasps> I'm trying not to die here, and we have 11 minutes. This is ridiculous. Hopefully the next game won't take this long. Australia. Why do they say multiple maths? I guess math has a lot of different... Yeah, there's different kinds of maths. Yeah. You know? We just don't say that here. I don't know why. That'd be a, yeah, you say I'd be a math teacher. Right. It seems more appropriate yeah. to probably be maths because, like, geometry and algebra are all, like, different kinds of math. Right. Like, calculus. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like you said. Right. It's all... There's definitely different types of maths. Let's say maths. Let's be those people. Okay. Are you going to say maths? Or are you going to say maths? Maths. Math. I feel like the first one's more nasally. Oh, I'm going to teach maths. Maths? maths? What if you say with like an F? Maths? Math. You guys, are you guys taking any maths right now? Oh. It's maths and Britain because they shorten mathematics but keep it plural. Well, it's still plural though. That's the, that's the point. The point is the plurality of it. Oh God, what did they draw? We are at four cards. We're going to draw. We're going to sack to the Gitrog monster. We're drawing a card for that. We're drawing a card for our turn. We have two cards left in our deck. Death is approaching. It's so, it's very, it's so very. Okay, babe. Really? I know. What round are you in? One. I know, Wally. <laughs> Love you. Love you. I'm going to go read. I did not spend... Yeah, I think that's a good idea. And then when I'm done and you're done, we can go spend some time together. Nailed it. Well, what about Wally? Wally will always be there as we spend... As fast as we spend. Let me see if I can... But you can't ever see him because he's behind this stupid thing. There he is. Look at this baby. He thinks okay. it's crazy. They're fighting. Bye, chat. Sure. She'll oh. be, she'll be back one day. On our, an adventure. Great luck counting, dear. Thanks, babe. I think I messed up your screen. Can I'll you fix? Thank you. I'm just going to go behind it and fix it. Uh, sacrifice the land of the Gitrog monster. N yes, I guess I will. Did I mess it up again? Is it fixed or it's No, you're fine. Okay. okay, so we can go electrons kill these two, binding kill this guy. Okay, so we're going to go white. Oh, I'm still in my upkeep. I haven't even drawn my card yet. <laughs> okay. Elspeth. Oblivion ring. One, two, three, four. It doesn't really matter. Get this guy out of here. Binding of the old gods. One, two, three, four, five. Kill one of these dudes. Um, 
So next time we draw for the turn, we just have to not draw anything here. Which means not casting any creatures whatsoever. If we walk the Aeons off the top of our library, we can sack the Gitrog monster. Draw one for the turn. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have one card left. We'll draw that for our turn. Let's get Nicol Bolas back. Uh, loyalty. Okay. Oh dear, wow, what a game, dude. And let's try to win the next one a little quicker. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my frigging god. Rexage seems OP in this matchup. <sighs> Leshnorn also seems very good here. That was pretty ridiculous. Dear Jeez. I mean, 10 minutes, we should be able to get there. I'm going to submit like this. 41 seems fine, especially when we have fewer cards. We have two bounce lands, so I'm not super concerned with not drawing lands here. If we go up to 60, we probably won't. <laughs> oh, boy. I wonder if we have enough good cards to play unexpected results, man. Uh, this hand seems good. Slow, but their deck isn't also that quick, so I'm not super concerned with it. We're getting close to Omnath here. We need a second green or a second red. Okay, they're just anticipating. Okay. Oh, Glacial Fortress here. Oh, that one's good. I like that guy. Well, we have no three drop. We'll just play Isolated Chapel next turn. We can Elite Guard Mage. Uh, if we draw a green or... I guess we can actually Binding of the Old Gods that. I, I think I'm definitely going to do that if we... Uh, if we get the chance here, yeah. Because then we get to search for a forest. Black one... Does it come to play tapped? I imagine it does, yeah. <laughs> hmm. B they have one card in hand? That seems pretty decent for us, especially if we hit our own land and we can Elspeth Conquer's death. We did not. Um, we want a second red, so let's get a Taiga. Um, what 
we doing here? I think we're just price of progressing this guy. One, two, three, four. Price of fame, rather. And then we can actually... Justice Strike seems good. Next turn we can go Treasure Map. I don't know which one. I'm, uh, put this one on top. Put that in the graveyard. I don't really care about that guy. Thank you. Oh, who cares with the resub? Welcome back, buddy. Thank you for the resub. Really appreciate it, my dude. I am trying to live the dream. Oh, 5-5, five, five, huh? Okay, well, we can Elspeth Conqueror's Death this. <laughs> yep. I mean, the, the, the copter's kind of annoying, but Elspeth Conqueror's Death is pretty good here, so. One... Two, three, four, five. Oh, it doesn't. That's not going to work. <sighs> yep, I'm trying to rush here, and that's not good. Yep, that was pretty bad. Alternatively, we could have... <sighs> Fuck. Golos would have been a significantly better play there. Wow, that was... It's really sad. That's probably going to cost us the game. Well, they're not crewing and they're not playing other cards, so... I mean, if we draw land here, it's decent. I think we're trying to hit an Omnath. <laughs> to... Um, two, three, four. Or not trying to hit an Omnath, but rather. Trying to hit a land. Wow. Yep, that's pretty amazing. Well. Yeah, we can't beat that. Like, they have seven power in the air. That was so bad. One turn literally cost us that game, unfortunately. Well. Yes, we have seven. They have 11. Is this any good? I don't think so. We can do better. That is, it's not bad. We'll keep, we'll ship an island. That Elspeth Conqueror's death was the worst. Oh my god. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, I may experiment some with Constructed for sure. There's definitely a lot of changes that just took place. Also, my article about the bannings goes up tomorrow at coolstuffinc.com, so be sure to check that guy out. Um, I'm just going to play Kiora here. For obvious reasons. I mean, if we can draw a black source and a green source. Oh, wow. Rexage just kills that guy? That's fantastic. Oh my, I don't have a, I don't have a green source. Well, I guess we're going to Oblivion Ring that guy. Because I don't really feel like having him around. And then we can Carnarium our island. Uh, I, I feel like Spirit Guide did not come out of nowhere. Spirit Guide has been responsible for every single broken modern combo since the history of modern. Like, there's no reason Spirit Guide should still be in the format. Like, the format just doesn't need a a Lotus Petal that cannot be countered and can also be cast as a 2-2. Like, no one is ever playing Spirit Guide in fair decks. Spirit Guide may have come out of nowhere on this particular ban, but I think it's just because Wizards was like, okay, that's about enough of this guy. <sighs> Not having a green here is rough, especially when we have a lot of green sources. Uh, 
we're going face here because we kind of want to just hit the um oh, i just want to hit a green source and then we can untap this it's not a green source but it is a green card that's significantly worse if we draw a green source next turn we'll have one two three four five six seven mana so we can actually go binding and rex age or Pelucranos and rex age Ripper store balance. Yeah, exactly. Oh, see, that's great because, like, now we have two Rex Age targets. Beautiful. So we can binding the lantern and then Rex Age the Stone Cold. Just give me an untapped green source. We're going face here. Fascinating. Five to the face. Green source. Come on, dude. This is ridiculous. Nope. Bottom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, we just wouldn't even have enough for that, to be honest with you. <laughs> Keep it on top. Done. Oh, boy. <laughs> Actually, niv would have been decent, right? We can untap. We can activate this. Get three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Right, that guy doesn't have haste, so I'm not super concerned with it. Now we can actually just kill both of these guys. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, do that. Um, Like, we know we're going to hit, actually, so that was pretty dumb. I'm trying to play fast because we have five minutes on the clock, so please forgive me. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can actually play this and and Pelucranos kill this guy. Right? One, two, three, four, five. Untap this, which is six, seven. And we get to draw a card from that, which is kind of cool. One, two, three, four. Pelucranos. Draw a card. shoot you uh, one black green the recovery Yep, you got it. Tireless tractor. Into one clue. Now we can binding this guy. Chronic Lantern doesn't do much here. They just have two colors anyway, so. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. One, two, three, four, five. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. We need another green, actually. So let's black, black. God, this is so hard. Um, we need double green. Oh, I think we can do it. I think we can just untap, right? So we can go white and then one, two, three, four. Yeah, we can go Niv here. Draw a card. Draw a million cards. Cool. Draw. 
uh, untap the green source. One, two, three, four. What are they doing here? Sure, you got it. Just gonna kill it. I'm probably not gonna pay much attention to the chat until the end of this game, just to keep it, just to keep you guys aware. We're done for the turn. Jump something down, pay attention. I was like, just dang it, Tanos. All right, so next time we get a land, which is great. A green land, no less. Let's try to figure out which one we're getting. I think it's going to be, I think we're just getting Taiga. I think it's either Taiga or Savannah that really matters. We have more red than white, I believe. If they want to dream, dreamy boy here, that's fine because we have Justice Strike. Let's get in there for a million. And they've had this guy every game, so I'm pretty sure it's just going to be Dream Eater. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I, I've had a I've I've had a good time with this version. I don't really have any issues with it. Okay, so you're gonna bounce something. Pretty sure you just put three lands in there. That's pretty good. I imagine you're gonna bounce Niv Mizzet. Kiora. Um, white and red. I mean, this deals them 10 here. So we can actually replay Kiora, untap a land, play the Gitrog monster. That actually seems good, right? So one, two, uh, three. Got a blue in there too. All right, so we'll just actually tap this. Oh, we just win the game. <laughs> All right. Whew. Whew. Shut up and take my money. My God. Really, Steven, thank you for the donation. I will no longer ignore you. Oh, God. <laughs> really appreciate it, buddy. Oh, my God. That was wild. <sighs> my BP is high, man. This... <laughs> It's mostly like the adrenaline. You're like, I'm trying to rush. I'm trying to win. I'm trying to not do this. And so you're like, whew, you get focused. And then like, it takes a little bit to come down. Like even now I'm still like. Whew. Cause like when you have like, when you have like two to three minutes on the clock, it's like, it's just, everything is like. Yo, also, I just resub with Twitch Prime, but it didn't make the cool noise. <laughs> oh, Michael B. Michael B, thank you for the 77,000 month resub. Really appreciate it. <laughs> we have a good time. 
Okay. Yeah, you go sack that Iron Mesa. Oh, man. Ugh, maximum clenched is right. What'd they get back? What does this do? It's not four pole. Okay, so they put a mountain and a plains in their hand. And a savage land? Is that right? Oh, God. That's pretty good. Um, Scrubberino. Let's just draw three. So next time we can Pelucranos. That's kind of cool. Oh, Garuki. Oh, next time we can walk the Aeons. I like that. Do they play? So we know they still have these two in hand. That's pretty good. Don't kill my Pelucranos. Okay, they played Mountain. One, two, three, four, five. Dragon Lord's Harka doesn't kill Pelucranos. Sure. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's uh, not. So, Savannah, we can go Justice Strike. Justice Strike this. Attack Garrick. Have a blocker for your beast. Walk the Aeons. Significantly worse right now. One, two, three, four, five. So let's go red and white. Kill this idiot. Get this back. And hit you, Gary. All right. So next turn, we can actually walk the Aeons, then play Nicol Bolas the following turn. Yep. Now we cannot. Unless we had a blue source. We did hit a blue source. Unfortunately, it still doesn't do anything here. We could justice strike this. Right, it won't kill. I, I, I know. I, I was also going to say that we could attack into it. Or shoot it with the uh, the Pelucranos to get rid of it, but it's not ideal. And Walk the Ends untaps gives us seven, but we only have one land to really work with. No. I think we're just going to keep up mana. So go white, red, and then black. Yeah, we got the... We're going to give them one more turn. We know they have one land in hand. We have planes, which they haven't played yet. Hmm, 
boy, eight mana, huh? Okay, we're definitely killing that in response to its... Uh... So we have... We want black, green. We want black, green. Okay, so this is going to be red, this is going to be white, and then we have black, green. Yeah, okay. Well, might as well play my land now. Yeah, that is correct. You might as well. Might as well, as they say. Do we just want to take eight? I really don't think so. Maybe we do. Okay, that's pretty good. One, two, three. Actually, let's attack into their into their Garinald. Yeah, we can just eat plants. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's walk the Aeons. Rakdos Carnarium. Bounce an island. Play a nickel Brolis. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Play the land. One, two, three, four, five. Pass the turn. If they have a way to get rid of Pelucranos, it's not great, but I mean, leaving them with a 5 6 seems worse. Plus, we still get to kill Garrick next turn. We get to play Fabro Elder. So, this is a 6, right? Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, we're in. Oh, okay. We were in. I thought we were in combat for a second. I was like, oh, cool. I get to block and keep Pelucranos. But we do not get to do that. Yeah, I feel like Pelucranos is dead. Yep. Fucking amazing. Cool. Love it that they have the answer to every single thing we play. Yeah, fucking cool. Yep. <sighs> yeah, I'm just going to concede because they have a Garrick with a ultimate on it. Leshnorn again seems fine here. I'll take this card out, it's just not impressive. <sighs> Didn't really see much for Rexage, unfortunately. Uh, sure. Uh, let's get a steam vents. Oh, we need a... Oh, damn, we need a white source, too. Oh, wait. Oh, well, found a white source. Sounds good. Good for us. Man, my kingdom for an electrolyze. And nothing. White source. Probably... Plateau. No, we have plenty of red. We have 
plenty of green. Look at scrub and steam vents. Now we have all the colors of the wind. Pocahontas up in this bish. Oh. Shut up and take my money. Oh, okay. Over the edge time for. Oh man, you guys are amazing. I love you guys. Okay, so we're gonna play Taiga. We're gonna play Pelucranos here. Black green, yeah, that's fine. And then next turn we can Great Henge off the double green, which is why we did that, and still play Simic Growth Chamber. Man, I love you guys. Donations. End the goal. February rent a Reno. People are gonna be like rent a Rhino. I'm be like, no, dude. Uh, zero three. Cavalier's fine. It still lets us. I mean, like, I don't really care about the Cavalier. To be honest with you, one two. I do care about that. We do need a second white for it. White for it. So one, two, three. Shut up and take three. my money. Oh, something. Oh, first five bones. Music Manly, you are amazing. Just amazing. One, two, three. Now we can actually shoot the Cavalier here, which is pretty sweet. Or we can just shoot Lotus Codus Lobra. So we have three mana. We can actually have four. We don't have a second blue, though. So if we played Dragon Skull Summit first, we could have actually played Elite Guard Mage here. But I think it's actually pretty okay to just shoot something annoying. I think it's probably this guy, right? Little growth chamber bounce a tiger, tigerino. Yeah. Also, this guy doesn't die to a lush knowing where this guy does. So, doesn't the raptor kill cobra? <sighs> wow, fucking amazing, dude! Both two games in a row where your opponent just has the answer for everything we play. Just really good. Electrolyze. I don't hate binding of the old guys. One, two, three, four, five. I don't think any of the cards you can get back are any good. We can also go get a Savannah, I think. I think we have a Savannah in here. You put the Raptor on top? That's fascinating. One, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, we're in like Nicobolus Eleshenorn territory here. Uh, there are not 41 days in February, but I really don't think we're going to hit it in the next 12 days. So we'll extend the February rent through March because, you know, it still goes to the same place. So yeah, That's pretty good. You can have haste everything. That seems not great. You can put two counters on the Knight of Autumn. Yeah, that's probably what you're going to do. What, wait, what did they do? Oh, it's put a counter. That's, that's less bad. Oh, Savannah it is. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have seven mana. Kenrith is actually really scary. Shut up and take my money. Getting your February off, Mantanas, you're awesome. 69. 69. How did you not say off to a nice start? 
Oh man, what a what a missed opportunity. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Dude, thank you, buddy. I appreciate you. So we can play Niv Mizzet and try to hope to hit Justice Strike. Oh, uh, we have seven mana. We can't steal anything right now. Um, one, two. We need a white. Oh, we only have one white source, so. Nope, that's not going to do it. Dang it. I mean, we can keep Elite Guard Mage up and, and keep up an activation from, from Pelucranos. They have two cards, like. What's better, six six or I think that I think Elite Guard Mage might be better here. And then we have green black. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, can we do that? I don't know. This is not going to help. This is barely going to help. It's going to be rough. Black, 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 red, red, blue. We need one blue source basically. Uh, I think we just pass here. They have two cards. Just trying to dodge that. Apex Devastator. If only I shot the Marauding Rotter, Marau Marauding Raptor, or the Lotus Cobra. Oh, that just dies. So that's kind of cool. Scavenging Ooze just dies as well. Okie dokie. That does not die. Wow. Guess they're living their dream. All I had to do was kill one of the mana things, and then we get to untap play Nicobolus or Aleshnorn. Yep. Seems good. Wow. They only have two cards in their hand. What could go wrong? <sighs> One man's dream is another man's nightmare. Truth, 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 truth. I'm just gonna keep saying truth. Man, it was great because two of their four cascades killed themselves from the Marauding Raptor. But then you get the nine drop that untaps all your mana, so you can give you guys haste, you can kill all my team, and then, you know, you got good times. So that was cool. I had a good time. I still believe in our deck. We got the Kerwitz special here where I got to play all the all the five first picks, the five first families. I wish we were on the play because Rakdos Karnam is better on the play. But I guess we're done. Can we get a white source and get a plateau? I need a white and a green. Unfortunately, there's no way to get that at all from an Arid Mesa. So now we have to choose whether to get the white or the green. I'm kind of leaning towards white because of Elite Guard Mage. If we need both and one of them lets us cast a card. Oh, Savannah's good. Let's get a Savannah. 
see, now we're doing it. Uh, one, two, I'm just gonna discovery here. Great Henge, don't need you. It's probably still good enough to keep though, right? We don't have second green though. Ugh. Yeah, you can go, you can stay. Man, Great Henge in the graveyard, makes me sad. All right, Karn Shitlord. So we can either, no, I'm just gonna play Fabro Elder here. Next turn we can play Pelucranos, one, two, three, four, five. Um, you can have the Swamp because it cuts you off of red. Cool. Taiga. Steam vents will do the trick. One, two, three, four. Ya boy. Uh, you can definitely have island and not eat to extinction. Oh, it's a snake man. So we can go Elite Guard Mage, Rakdos, Carnarium. Okay. I really need a way to kill this car, and otherwise they just cast E to Extinction, which is not ideal. One, two, three. Actually, Pelucranos might be better here. Plugin has got to be better, right? And what are we bouncing? Probably Savannah because it doesn't help with Cruel Ultimatum. Well, Death Touch Snakes are annoying. So one of these guys is going to get eaten to extinction, I'm sure. Yep. <laughs> Let me guess. Oh, look at that. It was eat to extinction. So now you have this and eat. Sure, sounds good. Mimic that. Things are happening here. I was actually really hoping we could draw that because then we get to play a second land, then we get to play Elite Guard Mage or Price. No, this guy doesn't give us a black. But we still can. Okay, so we're going to go Glacial here, I believe. No, we need a green. <laughs> Dang it. Yeah, we got to go green here. Oh, we have one, two, three, four, five. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Get Roggington. Get to play another land. Which gives us four mana here. I don't care about any of the creatures on board is the thing, so... Yeah, just play Glacial here. Give me that million mana. Okay, that's not bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine mana. We need seven for this, so we can go black, 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 blue, blue, red, red. 
Okay, we can cruel next turn. They just sack a snake, though. I've only been alive for like four, four hours, 15 minutes, Matthew. We started at like three. I can show you the world. Build the top two. Binding or Heartless Act. I mean, the Chosen Carl will be put into, into Giggles' hand. I guess we'll give you Heartless Act because Binding is just better. Oh, goody. Now you get to put him under the Mimic Fat. How nice. <sighs> Wonderful. On the bright side, they only have three cards. So I guess that's something. I, don't think, I guess they have two cards. I guess they have one card. Oh, boy. Yep, Alesh and Orange should definitely be in this deck. I think we sack the savannah here. Um, oh, Eternal Witness actually seems pretty sweet. Maybe. I don't think I want either of these, to be honest with you. You can put that in there instead. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six. Wow. Two seven drops, and we could have had six total mana. Or the seven drop and eight drop, I guess. So we get to play Nicol Bolas, kill the Mimic Vat, go up to eight. They have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight creatures on board. This might not be terrible. What do they put? Swamp? Sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, two... I'll make a guy in response. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, it's a pro. Oh, they didn't put it. They they put they kept progenitor mimic underneath. Yeah, that's pretty good. It still dies. Okay, can't well we can't get rid of Karn here now. So now they have Swamp in hand. Uh you can have Crumbling Necropolis. So you have two lands in hand. Alright, that's fine. 
I mean, we're definitely going to crawl to Manum here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we have three left over. So we can crawl, get back. I don't know. Omnath, maybe cast Omnath if we have, if we hit a land of some random type. Now you have Swamp in hand still. Just those two, huh? And that guy, huh? Okay. Block the token. That's good. Uh, destroy your Karn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we can play Heath and then play Cruel Tomato, but like. It doesn't seem better. So. We're gonna go. Black. Black. Red, blue. Blue. Black. Cruel Tomato, yeah. Sack your snake, totally fine. But you discard most of your hand. And that's important. Oh, what up, walking death? Choose a creature from a graveyard. I think it's gotta be Omnath. Omnath just has the highest. Um I kinda like Dragon Skull Summit here. Or uh Oblivion Ring, rather. <laughs> One, two, three. Let's get rid of your Ophiomancer. Play Dragon Skull. Next turn we can play Omnath. Wow, this turned around. So they get to keep one card and other guys just get Death Touch. That's fine. We have a Nicobolus, an Omnath that's going to net us a card. Elspeth conquers death to deal with Gonti or Murderous Rider. If they get rid of Nicobolus, we can get it back with Elspeth. They have one card in hand. Oh, I guess they do have the card that they took from us as well, so. Let's see if we're going to be hoisted by our own petard. Oh, God. Well, actually not, they have eight cards in the number, not as bad as it could have been, to be honest with you. White, white, yes, yeah, so we're just going to go one of this guy into this guy. Then we're going to go blue and green, Omnath Arena. Draw a card. Mm, I like a good binding. I might actually just wait to play this next turn, and then we can go. We can bind one. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mana. I guess we can't do both. I do want to get Elspeth down now, though. And eat this thing. That guy is now exiled. Um, we can go play Crack Binding? Yeah, let's do that. What the hell? God, I hope we have a hit. Oh, thank goodness. So we're going to play Binding. The black. Did I just add black? Blah, 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 black. One two 
kind of tempted to just play this to drill a card. Nah, that seems bad. There's no great reason to do that. What did they just do? Cycled shredded sails? Sure. Boy, that Genesis Ultimatum was nice. Yep. Cool. Good hit. Just blocking here. Sure. Glad we saved Electrolyze. Okay. Sad we didn't save binding now. And we're good. We did it, guys. Do we have a land to search for? No. Um, black, white. Kill this idiot. Yep. I mean, they only have seven cards in their library. They can only surveil three times. And next turn we get to Elspeth to get back, like, Nickel Bolas. Uh, one, two, red. Cast on myself. Let's get Nickel Balls back. Destroy. None of these, I, I have no way to kill like any of their colors, right? They don't have any white. They have multiple green, multiple black, multiple blue. Kill Carnarium, I guess. Sure. One, two, three. Yeah, they don't have enough. I can just kill that next turn. I guess unless they have a way to steal this, we get to ultimate next turn. Planeswalker, they that player planeswalker can only discard seven, sack seven permanents. They still get to keep like six mana, but they have no cards and they have Oh, they're going to pay some costs here. <laughs> sure. Oh, boy. <sighs> Absolutely amazing. Um, uh, any any plans on doing some call time sealed in preparation for the upcoming arena? But no, because I'm probably not going to play in the open, and I hate sealed. So, no. What do we got? Golos and a bunch of other stuff? I really don't think we have that many hits for this guy. So, two, three, four, five. One Kiora. With two cards left, we actually can't risk it. We also might be dead here. <laughs> I mean, that being said, I have been enjoying Coldheim Limited, just not sealed, per se.
This is actually pretty comical. Like, we're going to literally put them to one. <laughs> oh, boy. And we can't actually get that. We're like, we're just going to die. Yeah, that's... I guess this is going to be the Golos. Last card in the deck. And there he is. Wow. Having one more turn would have been cool. Rexage, Fleshnorn. <sighs> Boy, that's frustrating. Well... Let it never be said our deck does not draw a ton of cards. Pure is nice. Rex Age. I also have a signet. <laughs> Polychronos off the top one time. Okay. Well, that's fine. We can oblivion ring that guy. That's not anything really. One, two, three, O ring. Carnarino. I could have untapped Isolated Chapel to uh, keep up Justice Strike, but if we don't end up using it, then it's just killing our Kiora faster. Interesting. Oh, that was a good draw. Jeez. One, two, three, four, five... Kill it in response? Or... Yes. Heartless Act. Okay. Well, we get a blue source at least. Uh, Simic Growth Chamber gives us one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, let's go Simic Growth Chamber. And now we have black, black, red. So we got one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, this is going to be great. We need Nick a Bolas next turn. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Red, black, black, blue. Yeah, sweet. One, two, three, four. I mean, if they tap out for something and they don't have like Sublime Epiphany up, it's pretty good. Golos getting bounce lands is pretty nice. Okie dokie. <laughs> All right. Got me, I guess. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And Boros Signet. It's <sighs> <That's> unfortunate. <laughs> I always get so close to living the dream, and then my opponent's like, no, no, I'll live the dream for you. Okay, so now they're just going to keep Salon Epiphany up for the rest of the game. Sounds good. Okay, this seems good though. Because they didn't, they, I mean, like, you didn't play Murderous Rider and you kept six man up, so. What is this? God, Dream Eater again? There's my officer. When you do, you may return an online permanent. I, I don't understand the wording on this card.
I guess that does make more sense than Sublime Epiphany. Did they overpay for it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They did. Oh, you're going to bounce that guy. Oh, he did. What are they left to on top? So I'm still pretty convinced they have Slime Epiphany. <laughs> don't really care about Windswept Heath. I do like that. Sublime Epiphany! Oh! Copy my construct! I mean, if they have it, we're dead. They copy the construct, they have three four fours, they make another construct on their turn. They're just choosing their modes right now, so. Thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Kerwit, really appreciate the stipulation. I apologize that we went one two. But uh that's how it goes. Yep. And uh appreciate the support, my dudes. Yep, cool. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. <laughs>